Well, I'm off to one of the large London museums today, and um, I'm at London Bridge, so all very busy and noisy early in the morning here. But, uh, I'm off to photograph the Sussex chair and to get some detailed measurements and drawings. And here we have the Shard. At the moment, the tallest building in Europe. It's quite a spectacular backdrop to the station. Well, the Jeffrey Museum is set among some old armhouses, and it makes a very good setting. A little bit noisy being in London, <laughs> but um, the galleries go down the whole length of the building all around, and the creator's office is down the end there. Well, I'd arranged with the curator at the museum to take some photographs of the chair, and they very kindly took it out of the display area and popped it into a more sort of brighter, lighter area. So I took lots of photographs and measurements, and actually two things surprised me about the chair. One was, it was actually quite small when you see it in sort of real life in the flesh. And the other thing was the side arms are really very curved indeed. They really do shape round. Um, and perhaps the other thing to say is the, the bottom stretchers are actually quite thick and chunky. So it, it was really good to see it in the sort of flesh. You, you see so much more than just seeing pictures. And it really gave me a feel for what the chair's like. And here are some of the photographs that I took. Um, rush seating would be another little thing to have a go at with this one, so that would be quite entertaining. I've been having a good look around the chair displays, great collection, and also, they also have a nice um, set of period rooms, rooms going for the ages, so well worth seeing. I've taken quite a lot of photos with measurements of the Sussex chair, so I'll be able to make that now. <laughs> 